This year, thousands of people will get to enjoy Derby Week from a new perspective at the newly constructed First Turn. Churchill Downs invested $90 million to turn the once temporary seating into a permanent fixture. I think the people that are going to be here for Thurby Oaks and Derby are really going to be treated to something great. Darren Rogers says the upgraded area includes the first turn club on the ground floor and the first turn reserved seating on the second and third levels. The club seats up to 2,000 people indoors for an upscale dining experience with access to an outdoor viewing area to see the horses up close and personal. Rogers compared the second and third floors to a football stadium with more than 5,000 covered seats, restrooms and concessions, and of course, lots of bedding windows. But when it comes to the view up there, Rogers says you just can't beat it. Talk about a $90 million view. This is incredible. This is the first time you can see the first turn, the twin spires, the finish line from this high up in Churchill Downs history. Reflecting on all the changes over the Kentucky Derby's 149 years, Rogers says the first turn project is just another way to improve the Derby Week experience. We have to modernize Churchill Downs, um, you know, keep it keep it going but again respect those traditions and, and and respect the history and it's all part of the grand plan for next year the 150th kentucky derby this year we're looking forward to you know um the fans and their feedback on on the first turn i think they're gonna love the views i know i do and then you know next year will be the uh, the, the grandiose paddock uh, redesign madeline carter wlky news